think what art can provide is an option that has not been considered before. And I think that's important. When I went to Flint, the people questioned me there, like, what kind of project do you have in mind? Because how are you going to use us now? And I'm glad they asked that, and you challenged me. I said, well, you know, I'll pay you to fill this tractor trailer full of plastic bottles. And then I'm going to take them down to the company that transforms it into cloth. And I'll take it to the fashion designer, and she will design rainwear and swimwear patterns out of that. And now they're sewing Tracy Reese designs in Flint. I do feel that art is more a catalytic structure that provides an option that did not happen yet. It is a surreal experience invented to connect us with our reality. It is not about convincing you to believe in climate change or not believe in climate change. It is there to provoke a question like, how will you rise? And that is the most important contribution I think we all can make. It's not just about my art. Perhaps the project can be tailored to educate policymakers and encourage even an act of Congress to come about to relieve the problem. Because maybe an art project is not enough. I've been identified as being a socially engaged artist. I'm moved, as I say, not inspired, but compelled by conditions that I feel I can contribute something to, to transform the situation.